Hey, Fred. Um, yeah, video again. Uh, the making sense thing. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it is problematic. Um, you know, so I was sort of thinking about it, and it really is just about, oh, uh, themes or ideas or concepts or words or, like, even this thing. I have to go do something with this. Now, most people are going to say, I, what the hell is that? Uh, you know, are they going to draw a conclusion, some kind of vague notion of what it is or what it does. And uh, so if I make a sentence with this in it, <laughs> um, you know, it's going to be a messed up sentence for making sense. These other people, we're not going to have any standard definition of uh, the meaning of this. And so the communication is going to be broken. There's no way it can really make sense. Um, well, but then the trick is, it could make sense if all sense is is somebody saying, I get it. Um, if somebody might get it. They might say, oh yeah, uh, that's perfectly understandable to me. God damn, this light went out again. i buy some damn light bulbs. Well, I did buy light bulbs. Shouldn't say I have to. Come on. Ah, good. There. Yay. I don't have to get a light bulb. All right. So, um, yeah, so this, now you have a vague <laughs> notion, is a furnace part. Yay. Um, that, I don't know, but is that going to be really helpful? But yeah, I, mean, I actually guess it, it does make it likely that I will be able to to make sense now to you if I use um, that piece of information or that thing as a piece of information and convey something I'll probably make sense so I guess if that's the game is whether something makes sense to you or whether I make sense to you will be largely dependent on um, yeah, what we're using as part of the definition of what sense is, um, or what the pieces of, what the premises are. So, we're back to sort of the language argument, and, uh, you know, because all these words are broken, all these words are old, they have traditional definitions, and then they have, some of them have modern definitions, and so you really, when you say anything, what are you communicating? I mean, we've used the words like life and survival a lot lately. Um, well, depending on how you, how explicit you are in your definition, all life means is, you know, some sort of, you know, reproducing chemistry, um, you know, with no, no positive agenda, um, survival. Well, it's sort of a dumb word because you never do survive. You prolong a certain amount of time, maybe. You extend time, but you never survive. <laughs> so the word is broken. Um, how can you make sense with broken words? So, okay, I guess that'll be it for this segment. And uh, maybe I will add later. So, no, yeah, kind of work. Mo, okay, yeah, inside the car vlog. Yeah, it's not a car for driving, just for sitting in. <laughs> yeah, yes. Um, if I fix it, I'd have to get rid of it, right? If it really ran right, then uh, I couldn't keep it. I couldn't justify that. So if I don't fix it, I get to keep it. That's sort of what I'm thinking. But anyway, very nice. See, but there. Now, does that make any sense, right? I mean, so that's another part of this making sense thing is. You know, how much of our lives is rationalizations, you know, little perversions of logic and rationality and common, not even common, but uh, explicit uh, logic. And we take that explicit logic that, and just kind of pervert it to suit our needs, um, to suit what we want the truth to be, um, what we want to be able to get away with. What the hell that thing is. Well, anyway, let's see if the old thing starts and see what happens to the camera when I start it. It doesn't have a proper camera holder. <laughs> Damn old cars. You know what sense does that make? Oh, yeah, she started right up. Yay! 
Uh, check engine light though. <laughs> That's the nasty one. Check the engine. Yeah, I don't need to check it. I know exactly what's wrong with it. I just don't know exactly how to get to the part I have to fix. Yeah, they engineer it really dumb. But anyway, see, that doesn't make sense either. They put a very critical part that's going to degrade over time in a position that you just can't get to it. You know, I mean, it might be with a lift and, a, you know, if you had some sort of tool. So, yeah, maybe their mechanics can get to it fairly easy. But uh, for the regular mortal, it's uh, troublesome. Uh, so anyway, I could use a little air in here. I don't even know how to use this thing. Give me some stuff. Come on. Blow. Turn it on. It's hmm. interesting. It says auto. Well, auto. Oh, come no. on. It's on. Do stuff. Oh, there it goes. Ah. Alright, um, what else? I'm running out of gas, which is problematic. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just a lot of gas just sitting in the yard. <laughs> yeah, that's really, I'm going to get some gas somewhere. Shit. Alright, so well, I blew the rest of this video. It was a pretty good video until I did this part. Alright, but anyway, so the point is, is yeah, there's lots of ways to define this making sense thing, and so, um, but I think the language one is the most important one, because if you don't have the same premises, if you're not dealing with words that have the same meaning, what we think is sensible is nothing. We're, we're not even, we're not even, we're going go nowhere, because we're not talking a similar enough language. Oh, machine gun. Cool. This one did. Oh, anti-aircraft missile. Oh, cool. Submarine. Oh, cool. <laughs> Pretty good. All right. Anyway. Mm-hmm. Enough driving for today. Give it one more little zooper. Zooming, but not today. Okay, I wonder what those little lights are. This is why the battery goes dead, I guess. It's because all these damn lights go on. <laughs> yeah. And, oh, sorry. Yeah, I forgot you were still there. Um. So anyway, does it make sense? I mean, I mean, I got this car dirt cheap, and this is these are real leather seats. I mean, this is leather, 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 leather. But, you know. Leather, leather, real stuff, you know. <laughs> and yeah, you buy these new fifty, sixty, seventy thousand dollar cars, and they got freaking whatever they call it, you know. But it's just fine. Anyway, until next time and such.